Hello everyone welcome to success education today we'll be doing the workbook solution for english for standard 5 unit number 10 that is the supremo and please do like share and subscribe my channel for more updates now we'll start with the question answers who is the king of the sky in the poem so the sun is the king of the sky in the poem second one whom does he order to go away he orders the moon and the stars to go away third one write the rhyming words of the lines so sight white and light are the rhyming words fourth one uh, is the mcq first one the sun is called the king of the sky it's option number a second the moon turns white in the sunlight it's option number c next question is at what time of the day does he hit on his sorry does he sit on his throne it is he sits at the throne at noon second one write the rhyming words of the line so the rhyming words are throne and alone next mcq the sun reigns alone in the sky it's option number b second one the sun sits on the throne at noon it's option number d next mcqs first one is in the afternoon the shadows grow long it's option number c second in the afternoon the power of the sun begins to ebb and wane it's option number a third one the sun descends in the afternoon it's option number b now next question answers are first one when does he cease to rain so he ceases to rain at the end of the day second what happens when the sun goes down when the sun goes down the stars come out and the night returns again third write the rhyming words of the lines so way day and rain gain are the rhyming words next mcq first one the sun goes down in a kingly way it's option number c second the sun ceases to rain at the end of the day it's option number a third when darkness falls the stars come out it's option number d fourth one when darkness falls the night returns it's option number b next are the question answers first one what does the poet see in the night the poet sees the stars in the night second what will the stars show us the stars will show us the way to a better life and how to live our lives third is write the rhyming words of the lines so night and light are the rhyming words next mcqs are first one stars will be our light it's option number b second stars will show us the way to a better life it's option number a third one stars will show us how to live our lives it's option number d next are the rhyming words again write the rhyming words of the lines so night light and bright are the rhyming words next are the fill in the blanks first one the poet asks the stars to show us their light second the stars will guide us to the promised land third we need light of the stars in the night now next questions are the adjectives so you need to see the adjectives which are already given uh, in that the definition we can see an adjective is a word that describes a noun in short an adjective is a describing word so what do you mean by adjective whichever word is telling you how the noun is what is the quality of the noun that means an adjective and then you have to fill, uh, complete the exercise which is given below underline the adjectives in the sentences so in the first sentence many and small are adjectives second sentence old sor third one clever active fourth warm cold fifth few sweet sixth quiet quiet naughty seventh white big pink eighth three small ninth old heavy weak tenth beautiful red eleventh soft square twelfth bright clear thirteenth pretty golden fourteenth long new fifteenth tasty round and next question is read the following phrases and write the name of the person or the thing that you can think of so first is higher than high it is mount everest second whiter than white it is snow third brighter than bright it is sun fourth softer than soft it is silk fifth faster than fast it is speed of light sixth kinder than kind it is mother seventh cleverer than clever it is chimpanzee eighth sweeter than sweet it is honey Ninth, braver than brave, it is honey badgers. Tenth, naughtier than naughty, it is labrador. 
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज राइट एनी थ्री इंटरेस्टिंग फैक्ट्स अबाउट दिस सन सो फर्स्ट वन द सन इज अ स्टार फाउंड एट द सेंटर ऑफ द सोलर सिस्टम सेकेंड लाइट फ्रॉम द सन रीच इज द अर्थ इन अराउंड एट मिनट्स एंड थर्ड अ सोलर एक्लिप्स अकर्स वन द मून इज बिटवीन द सन एंड दी अर्थ नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन राइट एनी थ्री इंटरेस्टिंग फैक्ट्स अबाउट द मून फर्स्ट वन द मून इज वेरी हॉट ड्यूरिंग द डे बट वेरी कोल्ड एट नाइट सेकेंड द एवरेज डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम द मून टू द अर्थ इज थ्री लैख एटी फोर थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड थ्री किलोमीटर्स थर्ड वन अ लूनार एक्लिप्स अकर्स वेन द अर्थ कम्स बिटवीन द सन एंड द मून नाउ द लास्ट क्वेश्चन इज राइट अ शॉर्ट पैराग्राफ ऑन यूज ऑफ सोलर एनर्जी सो द यूज ऑफ सोलर एनर्जी आर सोलर एनर्जी मीन्स द एनर्जी फ्रॉम द सन Today solar energy is one of the main sources of energy it is the most important renewable source of natural energy there are many uses of solar energy it is used to generate electricity which is used to light up our homes offices and streets at home solar energy is used for cooking and for healthy uh, sorry and for heating water there are solar inverters and solar water purifiers also solar energy is also used to charge batteries of mobile phones cars and other things and here we come to the end of the unit number 10 that is the supremo i hope you have understood the whole chapter and if you have any doubts you can write in the comments section i'll surely try to answer all the questions thank you for watching my video and don't forget to hit the subscribe button for the channel for more updates thank you